Welcome to Friday Fish Facts. I'm your host, Ron DeSantis. Today we're going to deal with blue-green algae. Now we've already started by vacuuming out as much as we can, but let's get into how we're going to kill it for good. Okay, so what are we dealing with here? Well, it's the two tanks that have the lights off. The lights are off to try and slow down the spread of this algae, blue-green algae, which actually isn't algae, it's a bacteria called cyanobacteria. So that's why the fish and shrimp or anything won't eat it. They don't like the taste of it. It also has a bad smell. Now here's what happened. This tank here, I sold most of the java moss out of here. I had the lights on for too long and it started growing this stuff, which at first I thought was just regular algae. So then I transferred all these super reds in here. I thought, great, there's some food for it, but it's not, it's slimy, uh, pardon the interaction. Pardon the reflection there. It's slimy. You'll see all around this sponge filter there. It's that green slime. So I've taken some of it out by hand. You'll see kind of at the top all that slime there. That's the first sign of blue-green algae. Now this bottom tank here, what did I do to this bottom tank? Well, before I knew this was blue-green algae, I used the sponge filter in here. Oh, that's the night light. I seeded the sponge filter with that tank and then it transferred it in here. So what I'm doing to combat this blue-green algae in this tank here is I've turned the lights off. I just have it on for this video. And why do I only have half the water in here? Well, this is a 40 gallon breeder and I've gone down to half. So I only have 20 gallons. Because the medication I have to treat it, I only have enough to treat 20 gallons. So this is what we're using here, our trusty erythromycin. Now, this is, you can't get this medication anymore in Canada. You can't get it in the UK as far as I know. You can still get it in the States though. Look at that, it hasn't expired yet. I had two packets left. My last two packets are going to treat this. Now you can see it treats bacteria infection. We've already discussed that blue-green algae is a bacteria. So these are in separate packets. So it's one packet per 10 gallons. I had two packets left, that's 20 gallons. Now all you have to do is put it in there once and then leave it for a week and that's it. It should be gone by then. And because we caught it early, hopefully it is, but we'll check back in a week and see how it looks. All right, so it's been 48 hours. There's not a trace of blue-green algae in here, but I am gonna stay the course for the week. I mean, there's some mulm and stuff down here, but these crypts are already coming back. It's only been 48 hours. The coral here was had sludge on it, gone. They're white. I don't see a trace. So it's working well, but we're gonna wait five more days and then we're gonna fill this tank up. All right, it's been a week. We're filling this tank back up. I see no blue-green algae. There's mom, but there's no blue-green algae here. Looking great. That erythromycin did its job. Join me next week for another edition of Friday Fish Facts.